Hi guys, welcome. I'm Gary. Today I'm drinking Glen Grant 20 year old. It's a independent bottling from Signatory Vintage. Signatory Vintage produce Edradour in the Highland region of Scotland. This was bottled on the 2nd of March 2016. It was distilled on the 31st of May 1995, which makes it 20 years old. It was matured in bourbon barrels. It's a blend of two different casks, number 88172 and 88173. It's bottle number 478. It's bottled at 43%. It's natural colour and it's chill filtered, I believe. I poured a glass out a short time ago. It's quite light in colour. The legs are quite thick. Quite long. On the nose. It has a very, very strong nose. Lots and lots of fruit. It's like a fruit punch a bit. Fruit explosion. Apples. Honey. A little bit nutty. Maybe a bit of banana. A very, very sweet fruity nose. Onto the taste. It's extremely sweet on the taste. Getting a lot of honey, sweet fruits, oranges, a bit of banana, pineapple. bit of sugar it's a fruit bomb it's 20 years old so I'd imagine 
that's why it's so sweet. It's spent a long time in the barrels. It's a lot sweeter than a regular 10 or 12 year old whiskey. Have a second sip. Yeah, on the entry, you immediately get punched in the face with lots of sweet fruits, pineapple, banana, honey, a bit of coconut. Then it fades off um, rather fast. The short, the finish is short. It's a little bit thin on the palate. That'll have something to do with the chill filtering. I really like this whiskey a lot. It's sweeter than your average whiskey. It's very well made. It's not harsh. It doesn't have a strong alcohol bite. It's easy to drink. It's not very expensive. I paid around £50 for this. I'm going to give this an 8 out of 10. If you can find it. It's worth buying. Excellent stuff. Okay, that's it for today. I'll be back next week. Take care. Bye-bye.